from the fact that this bear call spread will improve, uh, you know, from where it is. Okay, so we'll wait for some time, but I, I would want to take it away because uh, this is uh, this is definitely in the money. As far as other candidates, there are plenty of other candidates here. I think Google uh, is one of them. So I'm going to select uh, Google on one uh, chart. And of course, we have Amazon. Amazon is down about 18 bucks right there. So uh, 150, 200. So 350. All right. So at 350, we are up 350 on this. Okay. This is uh, 200, 100. Uh, where is uh, it, it's at 575. So it's going up, guys. So I'm going to close this order. If we close it at uh, at one, yeah, I want to catch like 301. Okay. Let's catch it at one. So that would be a profit of 300. I'm just going to try to close it all. We might get a much better price here. Things are moving quite a bit. So uh, I put it at $1 credit. So which would be about uh, $300 profit on the trade. Okay. And you can see the mark prices are moving from 150 and things like that. But it's also moving like crazy. Uh, you know, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's going down to as much as 30 cents. And uh, it can go. It's going past $1 also. So a lot of, lot of movement in the option prices. All right. There we go. We got executed at a much, much better price. Today, Google went down to 11.05, and if the S&P is weakening, I would say let's get into uh, let's get into Google. On the put side, let's see a 33 delta, 1100 call. That's a round number. So let's go in for that, and that would be a five contract position. I think uh, we'll just get into a five contract position if uh, you know get a quick trade in if we can. All right, so we are in on Google. Okay, let's see what we have. We have 450. I'm going to take two contracts off. All right, got 620 for it. So let's see where we stand. 1107. So $400 for the day. $200 is still open on Google. Let's go back to Market Watch. You can see the S&P bouncing off a little bit here. So this is what I was uh, talking about. That um, you know, when it goes down so much, some kind of a bounce is imminent, and so you want to at least catch some profits before that. Uh, the ES definitely looks like it's uh, it's bouncing, so we have 400. I'm going to just take it off because uh, I think we got it at six uh, six ten before. All right, six twenty, we are out. Okay, looks like many people got filled filled at six twenty. Christine got mine filled at 610. Okay, so we got filled at 620. So that's about a $450. So this was uh, what 5.8. So that's about $2,400 trade out of which made about 450. Not bad, not bad at all. In fact, I'll tell you what the best candidate might be the S&P itself. Okay, so the because it's down 20 uh, 20 points, a little bit of a of a of a recovery could be in order right here. All right, so let's just wait for these option prices and see. Okay, one day left. We have uh, it's at 27.10. So if we were to go for a 27.20, that would be, um, and then 27.25 is at 27 delta. Okay, so here we don't need to go for five contracts. I'm just going to go for three contracts here. That is, if the SP looks like it wants to bounce a little bit. Okay. So yeah, this thing was at five before. Let's let's do this. Let's do this. I think a small bounce is is uh, is is going to happen. Yeah, it's almost flat. Okay. So where we stand is uh, a trade on the S and P. This is a contra trade, obviously. Uh, it's strictly from you know whenever at the at the open when things go down quite a bit, at least a small bounce is imminent, and so we take advantage of that. The um, like I said, it may not last very long. So this is a, a trade that you want to keep uh, uh, very tight on the leash because uh, it is going to be a down day. And uh, so at some point it might turn. But we are just looking for a very temporary bounce here that can uh, pocket a couple of hundred bucks and uh, you know get out of the trade. So at this point, I'm watching the breadth, folks, and we want to see more of the very bullish and uh, we want to uh, we want to see the very bearish coming down. OK, so that's really uh, what it is. OK, folks, so it looks like that's a good move there. Let me check what's going on. I have to check anyway. It hasn't recalculated. So here we are. 
uh, it's up 105 bucks only 195 all right that's good enough for me i'm going to close this because it's a contract trade and so uh, i wouldn't want to wait to uh, hold on to it for too long so 570 580 i'll put a limit order of six and go with it you can get about 200 250 dollars on this trade i'd be happy but this thing can change anytime it's a contract trade okay all right so we are out on that about 240 on that and 450 on google and recovered uh, on cmg all right folks that was a good day 